Double hundred from former England batsman Jonathan Trott led Warwickshire to a superb recovery against Middlesex on day three at Lord's. The visitors began dangerously placed on 146 for four. An early play brought a great sight for fans of cartwheeling stumps as Toby Roland Jones bowled Tim Ambrose. When Ricky Clark also went to Roland Jones, Warwickshire was still a long way from avoiding the follow-on, but Trot remained calm and patient, eventually reaching his superb hundred in a typically Trottian manner, moving across his stumps and flicking neatly into the leg side. Alongside Keith Barker, the pair rebuilt the Warwickshire innings, sharing a stand worth 143 to avoid the follow-on. That partnership eventually ended when Barker fell for an aggressive 81, LBW to Tim Murtaugh. Trot reached his 150 here though, and had good support from Jitan Patel, who made 30 before being claimed by James Harris, who also got Chris Wright for 7. Trot reached his double ton before T with a stroke of luck here, but you make your own luck, and he certainly earned it, scoring 219 not out to give the Bears a first innings lead. Nick Govins held his pose in disappointment after falling caught by Varun Chopra off Keith Barker. Milan went in an almost identical fashion. Opener Sam Robson and England's Nick Compton then steadied Middlesex, sharing an unbroken stand of 56 until stumps at the Compton had a let off here, meaning Middlesex lead by 60 heading into the final day.